Hello friends, Satyendra here and in this video, let's design this machine part in Creo parametric. So let's get started. And to do this, first you go to new, part, solid, assign the name and say ok. Now to design this kind of part, always create the add material feature first and then you go for remove material feature. So let us start this part with this base and for this go to extrude onto the top datum, normal, draw a center line here and here, then a center rectangle just like this, draw the line, start from here, make it symmetry, then this side and from here this side. Mirror these lines with this reference, go for delete segment, delete these segments and these segments. Now the dimension, so this is 100, this is also 100, this is 110 and this is 12. Control D, say OK. Now the thickness is 14, say OK and your base feature is done. Now the next feature is this feature and for this go to extrude onto the right datum plane, normal, go for reference, select this top surface as a reference, draw a center line somewhere here. Then a circle here, then draw a line, start like this, make it tangent, mirror this line using this reference, then again go for delete segment, delete these segments, now the dimension, so from here till here it is 35, then from here till this bottom, this is 220, this is dia 130, control D, say ok, make it symmetry first, take it as 65, thickness, flip inside completely, then this is 8 and say ok. Now if you see this feature, this side it is 65 and this side it is 36. So to make this, go to extrude, switch on your datum plane, select this datum plane, normal, go for reference, select this, this, this and this as a reference. Then draw a center line, just like this, then a line, start from here, go this side, this side and close it. Mirror these lines, using this reference, go for sketch point, place one point here and another point here. Now the gap between these points is 36, say ok, go for remove material, 2 next, then the second direction, this is also 2 next, say ok and ok. So now if you go to analysis and measure, you can measure this gap, this is 36 and this is 65. So this is what was needed. Now the next feature is this portion. So go to extrude, right datum plane, normal, go to reference, select this as a reference, draw a circle just like this, one more circle inside this. So this dia is 75. Control D, say OK, 
make it symmetry first and then this is 50. Say ok. Now if you again go to analysis, measure and measure this gap, this is 36 and this is 65. Now the next feature is this portion and for this I will go to rib, profile rib, switch on your datum plane, select this datum plane, normal, draw center line, then go to reference, select this as a reference, this reference, this reference and this circle reference. Now draw the line, start from here, make it symmetry, then this side parallel, same thing this side, this should be parallel. Now this is 18 and this side it is 25. Say ok. Flip the direction. Now the thickness is 6 and say OK. Now the next feature is this portion and for this go to extrude onto the right datum plane, normal, take the reference, this edge, this edge, this edge and this side, this edge and this edge. Draw the line. Start from here, this side, this side, this side and close it. Similarly, this side, just like this. Now, this height is 12. Say OK. Make it symmetry. And this is 36. Say OK. So, add material features are done. Now, I will go with remove material feature. So, let us start with this hole and for this go to hole, select this surface, then this handle to this surface and this handle to this surface. Now, this is 50 and this is 18. Now, the die of hole is 14 and depth you make it 2 next and say ok. Mirror this hole, using this mid plane and say ok. Now, the next feature is this hole and for this go to hole, select this surface, now this drag handle to this center axis the mid center axis and this drag handle to this datum plane. Go for placement and make it diameter. Now, this angle will be 45 and this is the PCD 1.5. Now, if you see the dia, it is M14 that means it is a standard hole and from here you select ISO. And from here, you select M14 into 2. Now, the depth is 35. So, make it 35. Now, if you go to shape, here you have thread length. So, I will make it 30 and I will say OK. So, my hole is done. Now, go for pattern, go for axis pattern, select this axis make it 360 and say ok. Now, couple of rounds. So, go to round, select this face, press and hold control key and select this face and this face. So, it will make the complete round. Similarly, that side, select this face, press and hold control key and select this face and this face for complete round. 
वन मोर राउंड हियर एंड हियर सो दिस इज रेडियस टेन सो ओके एंड योर पार्ट इज डन सो दिस वॉज द मशीन पार्ट एंड आई होप दिस वीडियो विल बी हेल्पफुल नाउ यू कैन लाइक दिस वीडियो इफ यू फाइंड दिस वीडियो हेल्पफुल एंड आई सी यू इन माई नेक्स्ट वीडियो थैंक यू